Hi, um, I'm Paul Jackson. I'm Wade. Um, and what we have today is the virtual virtuoso. Um, basically, the concept behind this project is that uh, if you want to conduct a band and really hone your conducting skills, um, you either A, need to gather a large group of your fan, uh, friends to you know, can play a bit as a band for you, or um, you can you know, try and conduct along to pre-recorded music. But um, the problem with the first is that it's a logistical nightmare, and the problem with the second is that you don't really get any feedback to, as to how well your conducting skills actually are. Right. Um, so to help solve this problem, we created this uh, virtual virtuoso, which um, senses your conducting and provides real-time music and um, uh, other feedback. So, so you, so you have a, so you have an accelerometer on the glove, yes. which is detecting your hand motions, mm -hmm. and you figured out some signatures of, of motion that yep. allow you to control it. Mm -hmm. And then the the microcontroller interface over here is producing uh, MIDI events, yeah, which then goes over to a synthesizer on the on the PC. Yeah, and so you get real time acoustic audio feedback about what you're actually doing. Mm -hmm. That's very cool. Okay, uh, and there's some. Go ahead. Oh, yeah. At the same time, you also um, get uh, beats per measurement, uh, beats per minute um, measurement, uh, which is basically the common form for, for tempo for songs. And that's on the the on top the line of the crystal display. So mm -hmm. that's reading out as you as you play. Yep. And the um, the second uh, measurement that you get is uh, this also detects the time signature that you're conducting in. Um, right now, it's currently only limited to four four and three four, which are the two most common time signatures. Um, but it basically, you know, detects uh, which direction in which your hand is moving uh, in order to figure out uh, which which one you're using. Because there's a difference between a four four bar and a three four bar. Okay. Um, so uh, play it. All right. So we got the first four beats. Why don't you turn up the Okay. Those were working with that. Sorry. Let's I'll turn this up too. Alright. Um, so uh, we also have a second song, just so it's not a boring scale. Okay. Um, and this song also emphasizes the uh, the potential use for for different time signatures. Um, our second song is uh, the the theme song from Game of Thrones. Um, so, which is in three four. Yeah. <laughs> The, it has sense that I'm conducting in 3-4 um, instead of the default 4-4. Four, four. I'm conducting at around 130, 140 beats per minute. Between 120 and 140, someplace. Mm -hmm. Got things to work on my consistency. <laughs> yeah, yep. Loops around at the end. All right. Okay.